What's up buds, it's Fly High FPV and I just want to give you guys a quick tutorial on the RGB strips and the RGB chips and show you how it all goes together. Uh, first things first, the strips are much like the 4mm 6S strips I've sold in the past. These are 3M adhesive backed. All you're going to do is peel the brown backing off. There will be a sticky layer underneath that will allow you to stick it right down on the edge of the frame. I'd stick it down and use a zip tie or two to secure it and it'll wrap right around the edges of your arms. Uh, on this end, the colors are going to be a little different than you're used to with wiring. Uh, red and black are not power and ground. Um, the way that these work with an RGB strip is you're going to have power is black and then the three colors are red, blue, and green are the grounds. Uh, that way you can plug them right in and if you wanted to, you can even uh, direct wire. So again, black is positive and the uh, other colors are the grounds. So you can make it whatever color you want and test it just by uh, plugging them in that way. Make sure that everything's kosher before you hook it up. And then uh, on the chip, this is the addressable driver chip. This is what's going to allow you to control the LEDs with Betaflight. I worked with Tiny's LEDs to have these made. Um, there's two versions, a single chip and a four-in-one chip. And the four-in-one chip is just going to be basically four of these and a single board, allowing you to have four separate color zones. Um, so those same four wires that are on the strips are going to line up right here on this edge of the board. The black is going to go right there for positive. And then you've got red, blue, and green right down here. Green, red, and blue. Uh, on this edge, this is where you're going to deal with power and signals. You've got LED in. Let me get this focused. LED out and then LED in. Come on, focus for me. There we go. LED out, LED in. So your LED pad on your flight controller is going to come right here to LED in. And then if you were to daisy chain a second chip, it would come out from here and into the next. Uh, so that you can have up to 32 of these connected to beta flight. Uh, ground here and 5 volts here. Ground is going to go to any ground on uh, your drone. And 5 volts just to power the addressable chip. Uh, the next power over is VBAT. So that's going to take 6S full battery voltage into here. And it's going to feed it right back out this positive. And then there's your negatives for the uh, actual chips. Here's one already wired up. Uh, ignore that I got the colors mixed here. This is an early prototype. Uh, but... The uh, main thing is you've got that LED line from your flight controller coming right here. Ground, 5 volts just to power the chip, and full bat VBAT coming out to uh, power the LEDs. Uh, there's also a 4-in-1. There's two versions of this right now. This is the first version. It's on a 30x30 30 30 stack. It allows you to have four separate zones uh, and the same thing. You're just going to put... 6s battery voltage in the bottom your led line is going to come right here from the flight controller to data in and if you were to add additional boards then you could also run data out to daisy chain more boards and then 5 volt and then any ground and then you can wire the four different strips here for four independent zones and then this will show up in beta flight as four addressable chips four zones that you can control independently uh, I hope that answers all your questions. If you have any, let me know. Uh, for a 5-inch quad, I generally recommend one chip and two strips. It's going to cover it. Uh, the strips are sold in half meters, so you need two of them to wrap the full 5-inch quad. If you're just going to do like a segmented bit, a couple pieces on the bottom, then one of these uh, is plenty enough to do it. And uh, you do want this chip to control it. Uh, if you got any questions or anything at all, just hit me up at Fly High FPV, and I will be happy to help you. Otherwise, stay lit.